We're live now. It was showing something. Don't okay, hold on. I have to refresh it on my end. Why am I on... Why is my Twitch glitch? Oh my, that was loud. Sorry about that. Technical difficulties, ladies mean, and gentlemen. Only on ECW. Yeah, what a good way ECW. to uh, start. I guess I can start by introducing my new co-commentator to ECW, Mr. RGW owner, Belby. Or What's just up? Belby1. Yeah, he did just say me, like, Belby. Belby's fine. Yeah. I know. That's how they all know you anyway. <laughs> Alright, so... In that in that case, Belby, are we, are you are you seeing what's happening now? I see the first thing you start off with, which is Balls Mahoney, self for okay, yeah, self so, himself. So okay, okay, so we're set to go. Then here we go. We're gonna kick ECW off with Balls Mahoney, as Belby said. And, uh, I don't know if you know this, Bubby. I don't know if you even watched any ECW or not on, uh, the channel, but, uh, Balls Mahoney and Sandman will be challenging, uh, Sabu for the ECW World Championship at One Night Stand. Oh, dang. Which, by the way, we are on the road to ECW One Night Stand now, four weeks away. Next pay-per-view. That is the next pay-per-view. Nice. Here we go. What does he have to say leading up to his number one contender's match? Oh, we'll just have to wait and, and find in... out. And he is also on our match card tonight. So Here he comes. He's... Well, we'll figure it out. He's already inside the ring. That he is. He has a mic. Let's see what he's got to say. Oh man, he seems kind of angry. He does. Usually, how everybody is here, around here on ECW, <laughs> except for us commentators. <laughs> oh, he's saying how he loves our business. <laughs> Isn't that just sweet of him? <laughs> that is really sweet, you know, it just proves that he wants to be a part of the company. Wants to still be ECW proud. That's right, and we have no plans of getting rid of him, so we're glad he's committed to being ECW. <laughs> he is. He's. Definitely one of the best we've got so far. He, but he's saying he wants he wants more. He's saying that he wants more competition, and he gets that though tonight. So he does get that tonight. He, I think he just wants to prove himself that uh, he can be the ECW World Champion. Well, and he'll have his shot tonight in our main event. Oh, my man. I believe it's main event. We'll check the match card before we go any further. Because we'll have to remember what's going on. See right there, he, all he said was nobody's done in the way of me becoming champion. Right there, right at the end. Right at the end. Yep. He already, so he, I mean that just proves that he wants to be the champion. Yes, he, he is, he proved himself in a ladder match. Where everybody said he wouldn't do it. And he, he just, he right out, wham, he just, he proved everybody wrong, and now he's being liked ever since. He's telling ECW that he, they're looking at the judge, the jury, and also the most important part, the executioner. 
And you know what? I believe it. I don't know about you, probably, but I believe it. I I I doubt I doubt to believe it, man. But coming up here tonight on ECW. What's up, uh, on Wolf Welcome to the show. You're watching ECW. Don't change that channel. So right, you're watching <laughs> ECW. Indeed, we don't want you to miss anything. So tonight on ECW, we have Peyton Royce versus Kyrie Sane in a table match. This leads up. From last week. Also tonight, we have Jeff Jarrett and Lance Storm taking on Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins, the WCW Rejects versus the Street Profits in an Extreme Rules match. Also, match number three, he's not the main event, my bad. Balls Mahoney versus Baron Corbin. We haven't seen Baron Corbin, but it doesn't look like a very, very welcoming party for Mr. Baron Corbin. Also tonight, Sandman takes to the microphone to talk about his placement in the number one contendership. Also, and then in the main event, you got an extreme rules match between Boogeyman and Taz. That should be an interesting matchup. That's right, and that Balls Mahoney Baron Corbin match is no holds barred, and that tag team match is extreme rules. So, Belby, are you ready to get into some ECW action? Let's go. Let's get right on to it with All the right. first match yeah, between right Peyton it. Royce and Connor Sane. Let's go. Let's get some ECW action. Now, this is the point where we rest our voice. Because stuff. I mean, we can, like, talk in there, but, like, we don't have to say anything, like, it'll be all quiet anyway. I just anyway. provide Here we go. some <laughs> over talk. Here we go. Ah, I got it! <laughs> Here comes Peyton Royce. Now, I don't know if you saw the last week, Bobby. I, I don't think you caught up at all, but that's all right. I'll fill you in. Last ring. week, Peyton Royce Disney was making her debut, Korea. and it got ruined by her opponent here tonight, Kyrie Sane. It, it was, it was obviously all these matches here at ECW are no disqualification, as you know, but Kyrie Sane just ambushed. Peyton Royce, which leads us to this match here tonight. Um, I'm not gotta... sure if it's my side or what, but the the video is really like it's there, but it's like cut now. Uh, refresh, cause my side looks fine. Hey, I'll get out of Twitch and go back in. One more time yeah. to see if that helps, but I don't know if it's just my side or what's going on. But well, I mean, nonetheless, I will provide the call to the action until we get the technical difficulty the over on my co-commentator side Kyrie fixed. Zane. What is going there on with go. our technical now crew? All right, there we go. Our technical Kyrie crew Zane is making cutting. her way to the ECW ring. I'm finally oh. able to see some action without some choppy. Action on my end. Not really sure what's going on. Yeah. But Kyrie yeah. Sane, though, making her way to the ring, yeah. hopefully to defeat Payne Royce here tonight. Our technical crew, this, this is Bobby One. He is supposed to be here. Don't be cutting off his feed. Don't be cutting off his monitor. Let's go. Yes, here. please, ECW. Let's, let's keep please some, don't. I'm well, supposed let's, to be let, let's on keep the commentary some water table. around here. <laughs> anyway, here we got Kyrie Sane. <sighs> And, Mr. Er, well, I mean, we have other things we could call her, but we will not call her those because <laughs> of reasons. Because <laughs> of kid-friendly content. <laughs> well, I mean, who says, who says this is kid-friendly? I mean, we got a tables match well, after all. <laughs> I'll talk about, like, anyway. YouTube Rise, but anyways. Okay, yes, YouTube Rise. 
Anyway. Anyway, here we go. Bell sounds. These two are officially underway. I mean, what are we? What's in store? These two fighting outside the ring already. Oh man. Yeah, they're already outside the ring. Already taken to the outside structure. Oh wait, Kyrie Sane. Kyrie Sane already going after Peyton. Uh, but Peyton saw the table in there. <laughs> yep, saw that. Already. She's already going Oh, and now up against end. the barricade. Gets slammed into the barricade there by Kyrie Sane. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be a little ahead of you, but that is okay. Yeah, kind of a little bit delayed, but that's all right. Only like about 20, maybe 25 seconds behind, but I can still see the action somewhat. Oh, that's all right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the play-by-play. I'm the play-by-play -play commentator anyway, so that's that's perfectly fine. As Peyton Royce now setting up the table, but Kyrie Sane knew what was coming next, so she reversed out of it. And the possibility oh, of shit. getting through that table early. Oh wait, mm. no, now Kyrie Sane. Oh, since Peyton Royce face first off the table. Belby, what is mm. your take on the match? Your first ECW action to this point. So far, I mean, it's all Kyrie Sane. Kyrie Sane just keeps on putting her on top of that table there. Keeps on slamming her face against the table. I mean, it's, it's all Kyrie Sane. It is. She's gonna do it again. I mean now now she now Peyton is on top of the table there. That isn't good. Uh oh. Uh oh, oh. slamming the arm. And the arm again gets slammed. Oh wait a minute now. Wait, 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 whoa. We could see the end of this match already. Kyrie saying to the top. And oh that's all she wrote. Kyrie wow, saying was for fast. Smash. That was fast indeed. She did a moonsault and crashed the table. Kyrie Saint is the winner of the first match on the card, though. Indeed, I mean. Here is your okay. winner. I mean. Kyrie that was that was big. Ladies and gentlemen, but, uh, if you like this action on the stream, don't be shy. Comment or chant ECW in the chat if you like the first match so far. Feel free to put anything down as long as it's not derogatory. <laughs> anyway, coming up next, we got tag team action between the WCW Rejects and the Street Profits. In an Extreme Rules match, I forgot to add that. <sighs> that was quick, though. That was too quick. <laughs> that was really <laughs> quick, but yeah, hey, Kyrie Sane wanted to. Kyrie Sane wanted to show Payne Royce what was up. Yeah, I know. I I I didn't expect it to go that quick. I mean, Payne Royce didn't even hit a move, did she? No, not really. I mean, it was all Kyrie Sane from start to finish. I figured as much. We'll invite Killer Bum after this. He can't be in here when we're doing this. Right. Is he asking for an invite? No, I'm just saying in case. Hmm. And this, those Hold customs on. load Entertain, taking entertain um, the millions. fans for a minute. As we wait for these. Customs take forever to load these days. Sorry about that, folks. We'll be back to the action here in just a moment. Let's see here. 
Those of you that don't know me, I'm Bell B1, otherwise known as RGW Owner Bell. One of Thunder's great friends. Okay, Sounds like the main commentator's coming back. <laughs> yeah, I'm back. Alright. I'm Here trying go, to look for some. Uh, the co commentator's trying to look for some, uh, or prepare some lunch here real quick. But I'm still watching the action from afar. Yeah. <clears throat> WCW rejects made their way into the ring for tag team action. A dirty plate. Hmm. I didn't get washed all the way. That's awkward. Oh, here comes I'll the Street Profits. The raw main GM would love me for this so much. Dolphin, <laughs> 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 this is a shout out to you. And this, this match. I, I I thought of you when I put the Street Profits in this. <laughs> Ignore all the planting, but Street Profits making their way to the ECW raid. That's uh, alright, there's always a bunch of noise. <sighs> Did not want that to happen. Did you, did you drop something too whenever you came back? Uh, I, uh, uh, some French onion dip dropped out of the refrigerator. Ah. I'm still trying to anyway, prepare lunch. That I'm was having ECW some related. Drop a French onion dip out of the fridge. That was ECW. <laughs> ECW related. Fine. Anyway, let's get on to with some. Extreme Rules Tornado Tag Team Action. I know I'm supposed to be biased here, but uh, really looking forward to Street Profits actually pulling off the victory. Well, last week I uh, hate to say, but they lost to the OC in a steel cage match. Oh, of course, it had to be the OC. I had nothing to do with that. It was both of their debuts, but oh, of course. But the WCW rejects being one and zero already. Three profits have a mountain to climb. Yes, and they then, do. And yes, WCW they do. rejects, and also we can't forget that the WCW rejects are also the number one contenders. Hmm. To the. ECW World Tag Team Championships. <laughs> so they and must uh, be looking forward to their title shot at least, hoping to get a maybe a title in her, around their waist. Yeah, yeah, they sure are. Uh, the, I, the reason behind them winning, they, they uh, beat the original or they, they beat the tag team champions in a table match the very first week, very first match of ECW. Wow. Yeah, I mean, it, it was definitely a big win. And, Sounded and like a big looked win. At him, GM looked at him and said, hey, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's do this, you know? Let's, let's let's make you number one contenders, and this is only their second tag team match together, along with the Street Profits. So let's let's uh, see what happens here. Is now it's a two on one. The Street Profits 
of the advances as Lance Storm is outside. He's on the outside. Oh, wait, Angela Dawkins will do a cover and a kick out at one. Making food ECW style. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, oh, stumps, no, bye, oh wait, uh, I can't listen to that uh, until after the stream here, oh wait, armbar, armbar, armbar by Street Prof, or, uh, by Jeff Jarrett, or, not by Jeff Jarrett, Lance Storm, one of them, one of them is, a. Uh, uh oh wait a minute oh chop oh a forearm oh wait Angelo Dawkins trying to fight what a huge backbreaker puts an end to that Montez Ford end of the DDT DDT and a punch to the face drop kick to the back Oh my. Oh my indeed. Wait a minute now. Oh. Oh my. Can you do me a favor? Can you uh, text uh, Dolphin in the group chat see what he wanted? He sent me a voice message. I can't listen to that. Anyway. Uh, here we go. Montez Floyd. Angelo yeah. Dawkins. They're going after the WCW Rejects. Oh man, your first piece of tag team action here. Looks like this, this is done. Bobby, what, what, the, what, what have you, what have you thought of this tag team match? Tag mm. team match going good so far. From what I can see from oh, the corner of my eye. Montez forward. Or Montez forward. Montez forward. Forward forward. I mean. Oh well, we'll to the back. Out Pick out it too there by Jeff Jarrett. Oh. Scoop slam. Scoop slam. By Angelo Dawkins. Montez Ford down and Jeff Jarrett in the ring. I just noticed there was a baseball bat that must have been putting the play. Jeff Jarrett with an arm bar. And Angelo Dawkins right there to break the that one The last thing that was sent was... A no, 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 he sent that, well, no, he sent that to me personally, I just want to know if you can figure out what he said to me. Oh, okay, like how, so. Or, how, or ask him to type it to me. Uh, anyway, <laughs> uh, oh, wait a minute. Sharp shooter by Jeff Jarrett, will that be it? Is he the raw oh, no, man? No breaks. Yeah. Oh, no, no, oh, super kick by, uh, Lance Storm, and a kick out of two. Oh, my goodness, all these noises. Oh, no. <laughs> all these phone calls. I apologize for all these, uh, noises going on. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> be now that out. that's over, well, no, it won't be, unfortunately, because it's during the match. <laughs> but I apologized in advance for all these noises going on. <laughs> and, uh... <clears throat> and... Oh my, what a, what a move since Jeff Jarrett out of the ring. Now Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins can have a chance to win this match. Maybe, just maybe, before Jeff Jarrett gets back up. I'm like, oh, there it oh, is. Oh, nice move. Angelo Dawkins. It's a spinebuster finisher. One, two, that's straight now. I was about to say the Street Profits won this match, but Lance Storm kicks out at two. 
Oh my goodness. Definitely an interesting match. I really thought it was going to end right there. I thought so too. You wasn't the only one. Um, but now Jeff Jarrett's back up in a two-on-one event. Oh wait, now it's just one-on-one. -on -one. As that storm rolls out of the ring. He's going to... Oh, looks like uh, Angelo Dawkins out there. He's stirring. But, uh, oh wait, 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 wait. Jeff Jarrett calling for him to get up. Angelo Dawkins is up. Oh, Montez with the reversal there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here we go. One, two, and a kick out of two by Jeff Jarrett. This is uh, definitely longer than the last match, which is good. We have to entertain the fans somehow. Definitely. We need matches to go a little bit longer, but Lance Storm back oh, inside man. the ring. Sends Angelo Dawkins rolling out of the ring with a super kick and he picks up Montez and gives him a forearm. Now advantage lies in WCW Reject's favor. And a kick out of two now by Montez. This is definitely an entertaining tag team matchup. Oh! Wait a minute here. Oh, and a Wow. Oh, now, now just choking him out. Come on, ref. I know there's no rules, but have some sympathy here. <laughs> <laughs> it is extreme rules, so I mean, technically that, that is, you know, allowed. Yes, yes it is. That's a leg drop. Oh, a low blow! By Jeff Jarrett. What? And that is also legal. Oh no no no! Pile driver! Pile driver! Oh! Oh! Go for how the did end. that break up the pin though? How did that? How did that? Uh? How did that break up the pin? That was so late. Anyway. Street Profits looking for a win. One, two, no! Jeff Jarrett out at two again. If the Street Profits win off of this move right here, we have to consider that an asterisk. <laughs> One, two, Street Profits win this match. <laughs> what an amazing match by both teams when Street Profits are able to pull off the win. Indeed, but do you really call it a win? Uh, I mean, he did pull off that lay drop from the top. I mean, I believe it was just enough to break that pin. I, I, I would call it a win in my book. All right, well, there you have it then. We will call this an official first win for Street Profits. Defeating the number one contenders, though, nonetheless. That, that'll that set up some high stakes. Definitely. And you would have to think. But, I mean, um, like, like I said, Street Profits are trying to make a name for themselves. Maybe, maybe that win could turn the tide in their favor and ultimately overthrow well, the uh, WCW Regents. Well, I mean, it won't overthrow them, but maybe it'll just set them up for a future title shot. You know, like, you just, you just don't know. Right. Like, how, what do, what do you know, like... Well, wait a minute, though. I'm, I'm receiving some, uh... Some, some news that, uh... Something... Something is going on in the backstage area. Belby, are, are you aware of anything happening backstage right now? Uh, um, are, are you getting this, too? Aware. Are, are, I mean, I mean are you hearing this too? I'm definitely hearing this. Um, something's going on in the bat. Uh, something's being recorded uh, in the bat. Yeah, uh, I'm kind of. Let's uh. Let's take it back there. There, when we get a camera guy back there. Uh. Let's uh. Let, can we let's, get a, uh, can we get a camera guy on. back there? See what's going on. Uh, the, 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 we're, we're, I get, they're, they're working on it. 
They're, they're working on trying to see what, trying to get us something here. And, uh, this is, uh, this is shocking. We don't know what's going on still yet. Uh, yeah, Tamra guys is currently not back there yet. I mean, they're trying to get into the action. Uh, even if it's action, we just don't know. We, we don't know what's going on. We've heard that ECW made some new signees and... Uh, oh, oh. We got a camera guy back there officially. Look who it is. Finally. It's oh, that Big Show. Signee. And Scorpion Big Sky show. in the back. Scorpio Sky, though, is the number one contender for the... For the... ECW Hardcore Championship. I mean, if you're Taz, man, you have to like this. If you're Taz, you have to like this. Big Show putting him out of commission. Maybe Big Show's trying to take him out of commission so he can become the number one contender, maybe. Possibly ending well, yeah, Scorpio's I mean, chance. I mean, it, it, would be a, it would be a definite possibility. Oh, Big Show just shrugged that punch off like it was nothing. This... This is, something has got to be done about this. Somebody go stop that. I mean, it's ruining matches, potential, potential matches. For the, for the, at the car that, oh yeah, man, so. one night stand. Oh my, oh my goodness. Oh man, now they're just, oh no, 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 no. Come on. Not, not with this chair. Oh! Oh, oh man! Oh, Kofi and Renee's doing the smart thing and running. Belby, I mean, come on, there's gotta be no mercy for this. Oh, man. Come on. Man, there's, there's gotta be something. Oh! Don't throw Big Show's mind. To uh, to cause this, I mean, but Big Show, first night on the job, trying to take out our number one contenders. It's, I mean, Belby, do you commend this? Do you think Big Show is doing the right thing, the first night on the job? Oh, uh, co-commissioner, uh, co-commentator is away at the moment. Sorry about that. I was talking to my cousin. <clears throat> oh, that's fine. But do you think Big Show is doing the right thing here on the first night of his job? Um, out I, I really the number don't one think contender? he's doing the right thing. I mean, oh. the main, the main manager, the main owner of ECW may actually punish Big Show for this. And oh, he just did the WMD right to the face of Scorpio Sky and knocked him out. I mean, I mean, I mean, I'm glad we got the camera crew back there, but I didn't expect to see that. I didn't expect to see that either. I mean, don't get me wrong, but Big Show on the first night of the job taking out one of the biggest... One of the most talked about matches to this point, and Scorpio Sky is being the number one contender. But nonetheless, coming up next is no holds barred between Balls Mahoney and Baron Corbin. Uh. So what you think of your first night or your first day on the job? Definitely interesting. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad you're enjoying it so far. Uh, kind of sucks that it's <laughs> not like and in the moment. You see what I'm saying? Like I'm all, I'm like 30 to 25 seconds delayed. Yeah, but that's gonna be the problem with all you commentate like co commentators. It's not it won't just be you. Right. But anyway, here we go. 
on to our next piece of action. We're live on ECW. Here comes Balls Mahoney. And here comes. Oh, his, his Twitter handle is all start out. Because we can't mm -hmm. air that. We're not being yeah, able to air it. that. <laughs> nope. But here comes Balls Mahoney. <laughs> And uh, he he had a mic in his hand earlier, but now he's he's coming to the ring this time for in-ring action. What do you think we're gonna see from him? What do you think his strategy is gonna be coming into this match, Belby? I honestly think he's gonna come out with some fire, like we saw in the promo earlier. He's gonna come out with some fire, still use some weapons right off the bat to get Baron Corbin down to his feet. I really think that Balls Mahoney's gonna have this match right off the bat. Oh, uh, and if you're Baron Corbin, what would your strategy be if you're Baron Corbin? I would take Balls Mahoney down immediately. I would get him down the floor. I would get him incapacitated right off the get-go because if you let Balls Mahoney take any second to get back up, that's your first mistake and only mistake you're going to make. That's right, and uh, don't forget, it's still to come. <laughs> After this match, we got the Sandman coming out to talk about his spot as number one contender. Definitely. No. That, that'll be uh, interesting to hear about. And here comes the Lone Wolf himself, Baron Corbin, still with his long hair. Yes, this is the brand that he said. If I'm going to any brand, I don't want to shave my head. So, <laughs> we decided that we will let him keep his hair. Definitely, I'm used to seeing uh, the uh, constable version of this of Corbin. But, I mean, it's nice yeah. to see the long hair. Yes, he grew his hair back. We're just getting news. He, he grew his hair back before making... Is entering debut here at ECW. <laughs> it took months, almost a year to do, but <laughs> he did it. I bet. Here we go. Balls Mahoney and Baron Corbin match officially underway. No holds barred match, I may have. Balls Mahoney and Baron Corbin. And it looks like Baron Corbin's got some advantage. Right, right away with that takedown, like you said. Like I said, this as long as he Baron goes Corbin. right for the takedown and leaves him down, then that's Baron Corbin, that nice strategy by Corbin. I think you're right, Belby. I think he has a nice strategy coming out of the gate here early in this match. But again, this... It's only the early stages. It's now we see Paul's Mahoney take advantage. Yep. I mean, I, I, I mean, I give Baron Corbin credit. He's coming out here. He's ready to fight. But uh, in the it, end, it's it gonna way. be enough. That, that's what I mean here. I mean, anything is oh, possible here. Oh, and now Paul's Mahoney out of the ring. Now he's back in. But, but, uh, I mean, are we just... You know what I mean. I think Balls Mahoney made a good match here tonight. Definitely, definitely. We're about to see who comes uh, up on top. But so far, it's been relatively, you know, even between even. these two. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Oh, Baron mm. Corbin just pushing that face into the mat. I mean, not, I'm not saying anything yet, but I mean, none of these men right now uh, have really got the upper hand, in my opinion. I mean, it's just still relatively oh, I agree with you one, oh, I, I agree with you 100%. <clears throat> We're still looking for that first shift of momentum to go one person's way, you're right. Oh. Oh, it gets the post goes Corbin. Oh, man, a backbreaker. Wait, he didn't let go of him. Balls Mahoney is just two backbreakers. What? Going for consecutive Into a cover. One. Two and a kick out of two by Baron Corbin. Staying alive. Close. Close. 
<sighs> this is now. I think we're seeing momentum shift. As, as momentum can... shift in Balls Mahoney's favor. Yeah, I think we're finally seeing a, a person with the upper hands. <laughs> and uh, man, as a leg drop or some of some sort. Uh, that seemed like it. It oh, seemed wait. to be a, a submission. An now elbow, it's a leg I missed submission. It. Yeah, it looked like the yeah, elbow. It's a leg submission. To the yeah. chest. Uh, I missed it. I turned away for a second. A pow driver by Balls Mahoney. Oh wait, though he's not finished. Oh, the pow driver. Usually, oh, no. usually we see a pin off of that. Oh, he's doing it again. Oh my God! A second one. Consecutive. Consecutive. Just like the backbreakers, still... consecutive backbreakers and consecutive pile drivers. Wow! And now a cover one, two. That no, that's not it. Corbin just got the shoulder up. Oh my goodness! Right at the last second, Corbin gets the shoulder up at two and a half. Oh no! Oh, spine buster! Come on now, that has to be it. Mahoney for the cover. One, two, oh. no, that is not it. Baron Corbin again kicks out at two. Again, I'm another close one. What? Mahoney just picks him up like he's dead weight. Into a slam. What a, what a, well look at the power of Paul's Mahoney. The fact I mean, that he can just yeah. pick up Baron Corbin like he's dead weight. Oh, and he's and busting wide open. We got, Corbin's bleeding. We, yeah, we got blood here on ECW. Oh, man, now a pull Now just sending elbows to the back of the head. Oh, My no, Lord. no. Oh, he's going to a cover one, two, and I kick out a two again. If, if you're Corbin, though, when do you decide to stay down? I, I mean, mean, he took two power drivers. He, 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 oh, he's not really fighting. He took, he took two consecutive backbreakers, two consecutive pile drivers. He took a spine buster from Balls Mahoney, which is a signature. I mean, he's still surviving. And now he's taking three consecutive headbutts. Head oh, and a fourth. He... My God, he, he squirting the fourth, head. Man. I mean, and a fifth! I mean, do you, but do, do you do blame Mahoney? No, that's the I oh, can't wait. blame Mahoney. Oh. I mean, he's just trying to do it. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. no, not the, the signature backbreaker for Corbin. Oh! End of days! Momentum Again, Swift! Momentum Swift! One! Two! And I kick out a two by Mahoney. And you're right, my Momentum Switch indeed. Oh, two and a half. Close though. Close by oh, both man, but wrenching on the neck now. Wrenching I'm on not that, that far behind you. And now to the leg. Baron Corbin limb targeting now. And, and that's not a bad strategy to do. Especially not a bad strategy Mahoney. at all. Take down the legs of Mahoney. Two and a kick out of two. Trying to take him down, trying to end the match, but it's not to end by oh, just man. a measly punch to the face. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Stomping all over the chest now, balls in my hand. <sighs> Oh, and now Mahoney's bleeding. Mahoney is now bleeding. Both Due to the punches by open. Corbin. I mean, both men They're are bleeding. They're both busted wide open. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Corbin! Corbin! Cor oh, Mahoney kicked out and he had his feet up on the ropes. Yeah, what he's looking to steal it. Doing? What, what, what is our referee doing? Allowing I have no them. idea. Well, I guess it is no old board. So, I mean, we're on I the mean, rope breaks. No holds barred, no rope breaks, so. 
So as far as we know, it's legal. Yep, as far as we know. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, oh they're fine outside face the off ring the now. Apron. Face first off the apron and an elbow by Mahoney. That, I mean, come on. Oh, man, and another one. Consecutive elbows to this point. And a third. What is going on, <laughs> Mahoney? Really going to work on Corbin. I mean... I guess I really did know. He's doing what it takes to keep Corbin down. And, and at this point, you're right. He's doing what it takes. But no matter how many moves he's hit consecutively, Corbin keeps kicking out. He may keep on kicking out, but I see if he keeps, if he does one more signature finisher, Corbin may be out like a light. I, I have to agree. At this point, it's... Oh, man! That's gotta hurt the neck. Oh, my God. That was painful to watch. Oh, yeah. I just saw that. My God, Mahoney with the huge splash now. Come on, Mahoney. Just in this match. Oh, wait. No, he's he's doing a little bit of insurance here. Oh, Mahoney with the spine buster. Spine buster by Mahoney. And now this for may a be cover. It. One, two. Live to fight another day. Mahoney wins. <sighs> Told you one more signature finisher and... It uh, lights out, uh, and I called that. And, and let me tell you what, that was not a bad call there. Mahoney taking the win, but coming up next, we have uh, Sandman coming out to talk. We'll see what he has to say, especially after uh, Balls Mahoney's win. I know, that'll be big. But we'll see you soon when we come back. Oh man, that was definitely an entertaining match so far to match tonight. I have to say, if it was my vote, I, that would, so far, that's matching tonight. Oh yeah, for sure. For sure, yeah. I, I mean, I couldn't... I mean, we still got one more match, but... So far, nothing's topped that. Nope. Alright, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we're back! Here! Sandman! Oh my goodness, he's in the ring! And he's going to have a mic in his hand here in just about a second. Welcome back it's to ECW, a by the way. Instead of a kendo stick, it's going to be a, a mic in his hand. Definitely different. That's for sure. Here we go now. He's talking. Oh, he's talking about laundry. He's talking about dirty laundry. What 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 does dirty laundry have to do with anything? I don't know. Uh, maybe he's talking about his own dirty laundry. I I mean, if so, that's kind of TMI, there, Sandman. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we don't need to know this. I mean. Oh no! Now he's talking uh, about giving him what he wants. <laughs> he's doing a Batista. Give me what I want. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's for sure here. Uh, I, d I don't know the reasoning behind this, but... I'm not sure what he wants, though. I mean, he hasn't clearly... Yeah, what does he want? hasn't clearly said what he wanted. Oh, he wants a title shot. Okay. Well, well, he's got his title shot, but he's got it in four weeks. I mean, I, mean, I, 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 think, he wants, I think he wants a title shot now. I think that's what he's getting at. Yeah, he may be getting to that, but unfortunately, he, he has to wait to get that. I mean, yeah, I don't think, I don't think he, he wants to it. wait four weeks. 
Wait a minute, though. Here, I'm just... I'm receiving word from the GM. I, I, I just got big news. Uh, so next week, it will indeed be for the ECW Championship. Sabu is going to defend against Sandman. Dang. What? I mean, I guess that's what we're willing to go with around here. Just handing... He, I mean, uh, I he's, know... He's, 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 he's listening to Sandman. I mean, just look what he says. He says, this is the final warning. You hold me back any longer. And he's the unleashed fury on ECW. I mean, I applaud the general manager of ECW for making it next week because if he holds off, uh, hold Sandman off any longer, we may have a riot on our hands. Well, I, I definitely give it the credit to the GM where it's due, but, well, well Sandman could possibly be walking in to one night stand in four weeks as ECW champion. Definitely. I mean, regardless, he's happens. still going to be... I mean, regardless, he's still going to be in that match, but... My goodness. You know what I mean? Like, what, what have we... What have we seen here so far? That, like, I mean... It, uh, well, I mean, first off, one. we had, you know, Big Show attack Sky. I mean, that, that was out of nowhere. We didn't really see I mean, that coming. Uh, that was... And that was Big Show's first night on the job. I mean... I mean, wait, wait. Oh no, I'm receiving more news. Uh, that... are we? Are we? Are, am I hearing what I think I'm hearing again? Yeah, I think we got something going on in the backstage yeah, area. Yeah, we got yet something else again. going on backstage. We need some cameras back there. Uh, but 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 what now? You know I have I no mean? idea. I mean, it could be anything. Is is it big show again? Are we going to see Big Show attack another person? Like, come on now. I mean, I, I don't know. As far as we know, Baron Corbin could be going ballistic. He just, he just, he just, sure, he just fought lost. in a match. I mean, could it be Big Show attacking him more? I mean, I don't know. This I is... mean, he could knock down Scorpion Sky again. I mean, it could be almost anything. Well, as, as far as we know, Scorpio Sky was taken to the, to the nearest... Uh, hospital, yeah. Uh, yet, uh, yeah, nearest hospital. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. That's Seth Rollins. What's he doing Corbin here? Instigating the fight. Oh! Well, ECW has. has, uh. Oh! Has Baron Corbin. Oh, man! Take Baron Corbin, Seth. obviously, oh, uh. Van Cohen was upset that he lost. Oh man! Wait a minute here. Oh! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh! Sing to the locker room! Oh no. Wait a minute now. Seth's grabbing a ch- Oh! Baron Cohen put an end to that. Oh, wait a minute here. Oh, DDT'd! Face first. Rollins into another chair. Oh, and now into the abdominal area. This has got to be stopped. Two brutal attacks by two new faces here on the brand. Concerto! Concerto! Oh my god, and another one. Come on, when do you call it quits? Oh my goodness! Baron Corbin just getting absolutely lit up with chair shots after losing just a match ago. Oh! I mean, something has got to give. What about the Baron Corbin fighting back now? Oh, wait a minute now. Oh, and a neckbreaker. 
going right back to that chair. Oh man. Oh man, rolled onto the chair. And another concerto. Come on. Oh my goodness, what is why are these people why are these new faces on the job doing this? I mean it's an error. Oh my goodness. Are these are these two out of their minds? Oh my. Oh and there it is. We're going to return to do our main event of ECW. What an interesting backstage brawl. I mean, my goodness. I know. I mean, just I I don't I don't understand. These I don't two understand it either. Just got their, they, these two just signed a contract with ECW and first it's and now they're it's, uh, Seth Rollins, Baron Corbin. I know, and uh, first it was Big Show and Scorpio, and now we got Show and Rollins. What's going on around or uh, not Show and Rollins, but uh, Corbin Rollins and, and Rollins? Corbin. Yeah, I mean, we, we, we kind of expected we kind of expected Corbin because Corbin Corbin was obviously fumed after that match with Balls Mahoney. Yeah, but coming next is our main event of ECW: Boogeyman versus Taz in an Extreme Rules match. Alright, here we go. Main event time on ECW. Here we are. Welcome back to ECW. Main event time. The following here comes the Boogeyman. Is an extreme rules match. Making his way to the ring. He's gonna be an extreme rules match now, here with Taz. As Boogeyman's now in the ring awaiting Taz, the ECW Hardcore Champion. It's... This is going to be a good match here, folks. I don't know if it'll top the last match, but it will certainly be a good one. As here comes the Hardcore Champion, Taz. As he has that towel over his head. Working, er, looking ready for a fight. Taz, again. He's he's a submission machine. He is a dangerous competitor. We knew this from the beginning. 
Oh, he's telling the fans to buzz off. He doesn't want any of it. So, uh... Let's get to this big, hard, core match to end off ECW. Here we go, Bell Sounds. We are underway. First main event was Bell Beyond the Job. Oh, man, and kick to the back right away. So what do you need? You need title... Oh man. Oh. Wait a minute. Oh man. There's a replace big car throw. registration. Renew. Oh. Oh man. Boogeyman. Oh man, throwing Taz in the corner. Just uh, dazing Taz there. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, clothesline. Absolutely. Oh, man, and a knee to the face by Boogeyman fighting back. Now, as we know, Boogeyman's also a fierce competitor in himself. He eats worms. Nobody likes that. And a clothesline. Covered by Taz and a kick out at one by Boogeyman. Oh man, and a, what a slam! Oh wait, now sweep of the leg there by Boogeyman. Oh wait a minute. Oh. And, oh man, a clothesline! Oh man! Another clothesline there by Taz. Oh, and, oh man, what a big slam! Oh, but wait a minute. And... Oh, my! Huge reverse slam there by Taz. Cover. Referee get in position one. And a kick out at one by Boogeyman. Oh, wait a minute now. Taz bounces him off the ropes, and an oh big slam. Oh wait a minute now, just absolutely wrenching on the neck. Oh, slams his face back in the mat. Oh wait now I'm back into a cover, one, and I kick out at one again by a boogeyman. Boogeyman just keeps kicking out at one. I don't know if Taz can believe that or if he's just shocked trying to do different stuff, but they keep him down. Boogeyman just keeps coming back and keeps fighting. And... Oh man! Clothesline! And yet another clothesline. And one more for good measure. Three big clotheslines there by the Boogeyman. Boogeyman to the outside now looking to grab a weapon. Oh, now grabs a baseball bat. Puts it down twice. And says, forget about the baseball bat. Now to go after Taz. Taz gets to him first. And a huge uppercut. Oh man. 
Oh wait though. Oh. Okay. Oh my. Oh, wait a minute, the boogie man! This is not false count anywhere. You must end the match inside the ring. Definitely back to fourth match. Oh! Oh, wait! Boogie! Boogie man with the table! Grabbing the table. Yeah. Now hitting Taz with it. Hitting him again. And then just putting it down. Doing the same I mean, thing that Balls Mahoney did, just making sure Taz stays down. And this is not a bad strategy. If if you were Taz earlier, you wouldn't have minded Scorpio Sky being taken out. But if you were Scorpio Sky laying in that medical bed, you don't you, you don't mind to see what you're seeing here. Definitely not. I mean I mean he he doesn't I mean, he doesn't admit Taz is kinda laughing going into this match. Because he, he already oh. knows Scorpio's guys for taking out a commission. And, and, and now I think he underrated Boogeyman just a little bit. Just a little yeah, bit. Yeah, Boogeyman is just nice. really taking yeah, control just... of Taz here. Yeah. One. Two. Boogeyman was an upset. Boogeyman gets the win. And Boogeyman overcoming Taz with the victory. Beat Taz. Yeah, oh, what an upset. Uh, this is Taz's first loss here at ECW. Of all the upsets, it had to be Boogeyman. I mean, with Scorpio Sky taking out, uh, thanks to the Big Show, I mean, you gotta give it a Boogeyman. Him winning against Taz had to has to bump him up in the rankings. Oh, uh, it sure will. I'm I'm almost guaranteeing this. <laughs> And if, if Scorpio Sky cannot compete at One Night Stand, you better believe a good backup is on its way. Boogeyman, definitely. Boogeyman's gotta have at least some some form of inkling in that match. Especially after that pinfall victory. The first pinfall loss to Taz. Yes. Well, folks, this has been ECW from myself. And Bobby One, we will see you next time. Stay at stream, my friends.